I'm going to do some dishes. Join me. Ooh, the water's too hot right now. Ooh. Ooh. I got them all rinsed and ready, though. I do. Now, we're just going to make a room for some clean dishes down in here. It's not scary. We'll set that right there for me. Ooh, these glasses are hot out. They don't break on me. Gotta be gentle. They're hot. Until they cool down and don't go. <laughs> I can feel the heat of the water with my right hand, but I cannot feel the heat of the water with my left hand. So, I know it's very hot. But my left hand's not feeling it, so. I don't want to burn my hand, but I probably am. All right, we're gonna get some more in here. Glad I read some of the other ones. This is going to go very smooth, okay? You guys know um, the show, it was a reality show, Kate Plus Eight. The eight or 19, they turned 18, I think a couple, few days ago. That was kind of a cool story. They're 19 years old now. Crazy. So today, is, tomorrow I believe is Mother's Day. So that's going to be exciting. And uh, 
I will make us a good meal for Mother's Day. <laughs> maybe, maybe I will help make my husband help me in the kitchen. Yeah, what do you think? Help me in the kitchen. <laughs> we could do some cooking. I do not have a dishwasher, and even if I did, I would wash the dishes before I put them in there because it's not really a dishwasher, it's a dish sanitizer, you know, so I'm not a germaphobe. I, I, people say I am, but I would get down on the sidewalk and lick it, that. That's how much of a not a germaphobe I am. I'm not a germaphobe, I'm a clean person, and there's a difference. I like to stay clean. I like everything clean, and but I'm not afraid of germs. No, but germs are good for you, actually. Heals your immune system. Germs. We use that uh, bacterial hand sanitizer too much, your body's going to be non-resistant uh, for. Body won't be able to handle the germs. You know, let your kids eat the dirt, is what I'm saying. Let them put your, their dirty hands in their mouth. Not, not like if you've been around somebody with COVID, obviously, but you know what I'm saying. I just thought of it for you. Getting, building your immune system to germs is very important. And so, if you're a germaphobe, you have a tendency to not. Have the immune system that is needed. I think I can get my lid clean, my spare lid, because I buy the refills to a bottle. This bottle is almost new. The label's curling up to be replaced. So I was thinking about just buying, you know, kind of a cute one, but I've done that many, many times before, and they don't work. <laughs> it doesn't work. <laughs> is that tup the egg, deviled egg Tupperware. And yes, I will be making deviled eggs, but I probably will not film it unless you guys want me to. I'll film it, but I might not post it. Because okay. I've done it so many times, you know. I should do it a new way. But. Because <laughs> I like a new way I make them. I, what I had in here was pizza. I made pizza. And it was divine and delicious. I put uh, sausage and onions and peppers on there. Cheese. It was good. And again, my laziness has caught up to me because originally when I went to the cabinet to get the tub where to put the leftover pizza in, I was going to just get that, the, my blue lidded square flat thing. Well, I pulled this out and said, oh, you know what, why not? But now, the cleanup on this, I have to go through all the little thingies. <laughs> it's 
so the cleanup on the other one would have been a lot easier. So I made my life more difficult by being lazy. Oh, hot, hot, hot. That's a hot to water. That's a, some hot to water. So I'm back on my depression medicine and I'm feeling much better. Back on the amitriptyline. Oh, it's hard not to be depressed when your body hurts so bad every day. All day, every day. You know, the Lyrica that I take, I take 600 milligrams a day and it does curb, it curbs the pain, but the pain is still there. I can still feel it. The burning sensation throughout my body, oh, my skin, my poor skin, and especially my left side, especially my left side. Okay. Got to... All right, so now we just have the, the um, silverware and whatnot. This one, I love it, but it's kind of hard to clean. So there's five of these. So I have to count them. And so there was one. <laughs> Make sure I, I wash them all. There's two. Three. Oh, you know, I think I did it wrong. Oh, I didn't count the first one. That's okay. I'll just do the first one again. See what I mean? But I love the tool itself. It's just hard to clean. It really doesn't matter. I could go ten times if I wanted to, but sometimes you only want to go once around. And all the new tools that I got, this right here is still my favorite spatula. All my old stuff is so much favorite. But I got some new knives. I got some new, um, here's one of the new knives. I almost cut myself. Don't put your knives in here. It's don't don't do what I do. <laughs> put your set your knives separate and wash them off. Set them here and then wash them from there to there. Because you can cut yourself and don't want to be dangerous. Don't do what I do. Don't try this at home. <laughs> Oh, there's a lot of silverware here. Oh, good gracious. So much silver. What is a girl to do? To do, to do. Okay. Just keep plugging away at it. Eventually, it will be done. Don't mind it. No business. Think of something else. You know? So, I think I'm going to beat that chicken once it thaws into a flat kind of steak. Okay. I got all the crap out of this. It took me a minute, but I did. Now it's just a clean. Okay, I'm almost done. Yay. I hate doing dishes. I honestly, I don't like doing dishes. I love the cooking portion. I don't like just doing the dishes portion. Oh, you know what? I, I do have one more dish after the silverware. My pan is dirty. I thought I cooked the sausage for the pizza in yesterday. All right. So many spoons is because of my I taste test my food. So I use a lot of spoons. As you can tell. I don't know. I taste test my food. Sometimes I just do it with one spoon, all the, the whole thing, because it's only me gonna be eating it. But um, 
for the most part. I, I use it in the spoon other times. For the most part. We got the pan in the lid to do to do. And this will be it. Oh, got a spoon over there for my coffee. I lost. Go ahead and wash that. Because I will only be having one. I hate. Look at the thing. See, it has water in there. It's one downfall of these pans is getting the water underneath the handle and out of the handle. Alright, so that's the least part. Let's put that next And, alright, I'm going to have to get a screwdriver. Much better. Just put that little pocket back in. I love the pans, except for that. Because it's not that I didn't tighten it enough, it's that it loosens as you use it. So, but I love the pans. They are elite. I believe that is the name of it. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, S, S Light Life. A slight life that is the, and they are wonderful pans my daughter bought them for me for my birthday last year I'm very happy with them all right so this water is still fr fairly fresh and hot so we're gonna leave it so we can do our dishes as we go today and cut out of there Let's just counter wipe that all right it's not the faucet, it's the sink. And this one is a brand new one. The other one broke. So. It's the same amount of noise. I thought I could get it to quiet down. All right. Thank you for joining me to do my dishes. I'm going to start doing some food prep after a short break, and I will see you on the next video. Have a great day. Bye.